Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great rare Class B camper van value from Parkway RV Center. Folks, got another Leisure Travel today to show you. This is the 2006 Leisure Travel Free Spirit. Model number is a 210B. It's 22 feet long overall, bumper to bumper at its longest point. Uh, built on the Freightliner Sprinter chassis which Freightliner, Dodge, and Mercedes were all the same thing back then. Uh, it's a Mercedes chassis. Got the 2.7 liter inline five cylinder turbo diesel. Got only has 56,000 miles on it, folks. This is a one owner out of Alabama, so this isn't something that's been up north. You gotta worry about rust or anything like that. This is a beautiful coach, folks. One of the most fuel efficient motor homes, if not the most fuel efficient motor home you can buy. Now, if you want to drive down the interstate 70, 75 miles an hour, you're going to get 21, 22 miles a gallon. If you want to slow it down, do about 55. I've heard reports of people getting 25 plus miles per gallon driving that slow. So definitely, um, I mean, it gets better fuel mileage than, than, than many of today's smaller and mid-size SUVs. Got a 2.8 Onan propane generator running right now. It's built on a 2500 Mercedes Sprinter chassis. It's uh, I know it says Freightliner, folks, but they're all Mercedes. They're all the same, Dodge, Freightliner, and uh, Mercedes. They all got the Mercedes uh, five-cylinder turbo diesel, the five-speed automatic transmission, and more. The folks, these are designed by Mercedes uh, with proper factory maintenance to go half a million miles. The Sprinter chassis is also designed to go 10,000 miles between oil changes. So you've got less maintenance cost and longer engine life as well as an incredible fuel mileage. It's got 154 horsepower, 243 pound-feet of torque, but you got to look at the size vehicle and weight you're driving. I mean, folks, this thing's got V8 like performance out of a five cylinder diesel getting 22 miles a gallon. So you can see why they're so popular. Got a 5,000 pound uh, towing capacity and hitch on the back. Spare tire with a Continental kit on the back. Doesn't look like it's ever been on the ground. The tires look almost brand new. Got a six gallon gas electric water heater. These are Canadian built units, so they're built for cold weather. And I've had the privilege of listing a lot of these for sale over the years if you want to go back through my video. Paint body looks incredible. I know it's a little wet outside today, but 2500 SHC Mercedes Sprinter chassis. Got the alloy wheels. Ideal couples motorhome. And it makes a big, it's almost got a king size bed in it. Paint on the hood looks good. Looks like got a couple little bug specks on the front. Nothing going to hurt it. Got a crank out awning, running boards. And I love this too. Sliding van doors. I miss those. But anyway, let's look inside. I especially like it when you're parking somewhere because I've got a full-size van myself. And if somebody gets too close to you, you can still open and close your door uh, with these sliding doors instead of the swing-out doors like the front ones right here. But anyway, look up here in the front real quick. You can see I like the fact there's no carpet in the front, so it's very easy to keep the front cab very clean. you got these really pretty burgundy leather seats, LTV, leisure travel vehicle. Got the wood grain kit. Of course, this is all German engineering, folks. I mean, you've got an incredibly reliable machine right here. Um, dash air's ice cold. Heat works great. Um, in fact, I've, I've got, I had the air on checking it out. Let's see here. I want to show you. You can see it's blowing out pretty cold considering right here at Idle. It's blowing out 40s, 30s. Uh, Sony CD player, tilt, cruise. Door panels look great. This has not been a smoker's unit. Um, there's no smoke, no pet odors. Or... Sorry about that, folks. Hit the hit the stop button accidentally. Uh, open up the 
driver's seat here. You can see door panel looks great. Uh, now the front seat, the passenger side does swivel. I do not believe this one does, the, dri the driver's side. Look here on the thing, there's no check engine lights. 56,251 miles to be exact. Tilt cruise, um, headliner looks perfect. Got the uh, ride right adjustable air suspension with the built-in air compressor so you can firm up or soften up your ride as you go down the road. Got a brake controller right here if you want to tow something. Um, Let's go around, look back inside. As we look inside, folks, got a six foot one inch interior ceiling heights for those of you who are taller. Uh, I'm six foot three, unfortunately. I can't stand up all the way, but I can almost. Leather furniture in here, folks. This right here in the back, that's a power sofa. And you use these two ottomans, you make a 68 by 75 inch bed, almost a king size bed. Got a little uh, TV right here. Um, day night shades. It's got the table that sets up right here. It's inside the closet uh, right here. And it looks like new. There's your leg. Got the, uh, I like the fact there's very little carpet in here, folks. Um, I don't even know why they put carpet right there. That's kind of odd, but um, just carpet in the back bedroom area or living room area. Uh, generator, obviously running, 323 hours. Um, there's all your controls right here, tank monitors, uh, battery disconnect and all that stuff. I've got a factory brochure in here that you can look through in person or if you go to my website, parkwayrvcenter.com or if you're on YouTube, I made it real easy go on the video description, click on the link in the first paragraph, it'll take you to my used Class B camper van page, and I'll have a, this available on there in PDF. If you read that, you'll know more about it than I do. I like the bathroom setup in these leisure travels over the road treks. You know, the road treks, you got to take a shower in the hallway, and <coughs> unfortunately, you're blocking access to the rest of the RV while you're taking a shower. These right here, everything's enclosed on the side. This is all a fiberglass surround. So you don't have any, uh, you don't have to worry about getting anything wet. You've got a shower curtain that goes across the front here if you want to leave these doors open. Got the toilet, of course, six gallon DSI water heater, um, gas electric. Kitchen area, considering you're only in a 22 foot vehicle, pretty darn impressive. Of course, I think they've added some of these spice racks but I guess they like to cook <laughs> uh, sink I like the fact you've got this sink cover built in for extra food prep and countertop space doesn't look like they really cooked any in here that's 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 unusual to have all those spice racks and not 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 really cook in it but hey whatever floats your boat I guess this is what they call a three-way RV refrigerator freezer. It can run off propane gas, electric, or 12-volt battery. Let's see if I can tell if it's getting cold yet. Uh, it's getting there. I'll try to show it to you here. I don't know if I can hold this door open and this at the same time. I think it's got a pretty healthy spring on it. 12 degrees, 11 degrees. Now the fridge has probably not gotten, well it's actually getting pretty close to operating temp. You know it takes these things a few hours. I've had it running about an hour or so. It's it's getting there and of course it's cooler outside too. Um, you know it's about 40, 48, 49 degrees right now. Heat pump works great. It's got a 16,000 BTU propane furnace as well as an electric heat pump and um, and you can see it's blowing 85 degree heat out the electric part and if it gets really cold you flip that propane furnace on and it'll roast you um, power sofa works of course I'm not gonna fold it out all the way but I'll give you an idea here the way it works 
you fold that down all the way and then you put your tabletop that's in the closet right here on these two trays and then you put your cushions across for your mattress and that makes a king size or, or very close to a king size bed definitely bigger than a queen remember 68 by 76 so a good size that's a bigger bed than my uh, 38 foot class A motorhome has and of course in the, in the morning time you just push a button and set everything back up just like that and they didn't waste any space in here the engineering that goes into these to me has always been really amazing because there's no wasted space. Every nook and cranny has some kind of storage in it. Um, you open these overhead compartments and they're pretty deep too. So, I mean, it's definitely, considering the size vehicle that you're traveling in, has got impressive storage. You know, I've always been a big leisure travel fan. I'm, I've seen these things from the 80s that still look good they make a nice product got the little chrome backsplash right there big closet of course in here with the table in it microwave so nothing wasted anyway folks like I said, incredible fuel mileage. You can drive it and park it in a regular parking spot. These things are one of the most popular uh, used motorhomes on the market. That's a Class B camper van. I mean, these things, people buy these things. Couples buy them because the husband and wife both can drive it, no problem. I mean, folks, if you can drive an SUV, a midsize SUV, you can drive this thing and park it without any problem. I mean, it's so easy to do. Um, and these things get good power too. I mean, I know 154 horsepower doesn't sound like a lot, but you've got to look at the torque. And it says in the factory brochure it's a V8 performance, and it, it definitely gives you that feeling. I mean, if you want to drive 75, 80 miles an hour on the interstate, you can do it with this van all day long. It's got plenty of power, and it'll get there pretty quick too, uh, considering the what you've got. Of course, I know they're not they're not a hot rod by no means, but they'll get you down the road at a comfortable rate of speed. You know, like I said, they're more designed for fuel economy and durability than power. And I'm sure somewhere out there you can turn these things up and get more power out of them, but I wouldn't. I don't recommend it. I think these things have plenty of power for what you're going to use it for. You know, part of the RV lifestyle, folks, is taking it easy. And, you know, the difference between driving an RV and a car, well... In a car, you travel to get there. You want to get there as quick as possible and be at your destination. When you travel in an RV, it's, it's, it's about the destination and it's about the journey. I mean, I can't tell you how many times tra traveling in my own motorhomes that I've stopped somewhere, stayed a couple hours, seen something interesting, parks and stuff like that, stopped, had a picnic or had a little cookout just randomly out of the blue while I'm traveling somewhere else. I mean, that's what, that's what it is. I don't travel with any, um, you know, and I'll have reservations at an RV park, but there's been times that I've showed up a day or two late because I saw some place I wanted to stop at. So definitely, folks, um, RVing is, is, is just a laid back, you know, sit in the right lane, run 65, 70 miles an hour, whatever speed you're comfortable with. And enjoy the trip as much as the destination. Um, and these vans can help you do that. And these vans, folks, I sell a bunch of these because they're such a versatile vehicle. With the fuel mileage they get, I mean, it's very easy to keep this as a second vehicle or a spare vehicle. In case your main vehicle's in the shop, you can drive this to work. I mean, there's nothing to driving and parking this little van. Um, day trips, weekend trips. I mean, you don't have to leave this thing in the driveway and just use it once or twice a year like people do with the big class A's. I mean, you can use these for uh, taking the kids school shopping at the mall or, or um, going to a cookout or a football game or anything like that, folks. Tailgating. 
sporting events. I mean, you can get out and just take it out for a Sunday drive and, and go to flea markets and yard sales and drive at the church and all that, folks, and visit family and more. I mean, you don't have to spend the night in it. You can just get out and use it and enjoy driving it. You know, it's comfortable, and it's only 22 feet long. I mean, it's, it's about as small as you can get in a self-contained motorhome. Anyway, folks, I've got a pretty good selection of these Class Bs, and I've got some more I'm hopefully going to be posting in the next few days. Um, you know, I've, you know, the well kind of ran dry for a little while on these used Class B vans, but I've, we found some sources, and they broke loose a little bit, and we've got a few of these coming in. Uh, so if you're definitely looking for a Class B camper van, and you're not already a sub uh, subscriber to my YouTube channel, go ahead and click on the subscribe button. You're going to see several of them over the next few days, but they go quick, folks. You got to realize these Class B camper vans are so hard to find used that people distance is no factor. You know, we're a Class A or a Class C. Somebody might drive a few hundred miles, maybe even a thousand miles. But for somebody for somebody looking for these used Class Bs, are so few and far between that it's nothing for me to get somebody that travels 2,500, 3,000 miles to buy one of these from us because they can't find them. And this price is incredible, folks. Forty nine nine for this low mileage 2006 leisure travel in excellent condition. I've actually got two of these in stock. Now I've got one for five grand less. It's got more miles. It's got 102,000 miles, but it's a diesel too. So keep that in mind. They're designed to run half a million miles. So I've got this one. I've got that one and I've got some road treks. I've got some uh, leisure. Uh, not leisure travel. I've got some Ameri American Cruiser coming in. I've got some really neat um, Class B's coming in in, in pretty much everybody's price range. So if you're interested in a Class B, even if it's not this one, give my salespeople a call at 706-965-7929. They can tell you what else we got on the lot that I haven't posted online yet. Folks, we spent a million dollars last week on inventory. We spent thirty. We've got thirty-five plus units coming in. We've got several of them in, of course, and I'm gonna be posting them as quick as I possibly can. But you know, if you don't see what you're looking for on my videos, or if you go to my website and don't see what you're looking for, we still have a lot more that I'm gonna be posting online. So, call my sales department or send them an email at sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Tell them what you're looking for. Put your contact info down. We may have your unit sitting here on the lot right now, just not posted online. If you got any questions, again, our phone number is 706-965-7929. Now, let's talk about pricing for a minute. The option A, haggle-free price on this leisure travel is $49.9. And when I mean haggle-free, folks, no offers. We don't accept offers. You know, we, we don't negotiate. That's the price, you know. We, you know, I think the old haggling days are long in the past, thanks to the internet. I mean, here's the thing, folks. I know you're going to get online. You're going to research 2006 Leisure Travel, look at them with the, this condition, with this many miles, and you'll see this is the lowest price one on the internet. So there's no point negotiating because if the price wasn't attractive, you wouldn't be here to begin with. And same way with the TV. I'm mean, here's the thing. You, you know, you you want to buy, say, a 55 inch TV. You, you search Walmart, Amazon, Best Buy, all those other stores, the one with the lowest price is the one you're going to go to. And and you don't go in there and you see, a, say, a TV for $399. Hey, you taking any less for it? Of course not. You paid the $399. I mean, that's they were the cheapest one you found on the Internet. It's the same concept with us, folks. We went haggle-free years ago. Instead of marking these things up an additional several thousand dollars, and then start haggling. We just cut all that nonsense out, put our lowest price on there. Here it is. Now, if you want to haggle, we can do it the old-fashioned way. We can mark it up to $59.9, and we'll start haggling. Or we can put you right on the money, $49.9. This is what all you get, folks. You get this beautiful 06 Leisure Travel 21B with 56,000 miles, diesel, credible fuel mileage, generator, everything functioning on it we're going to go through this thing after purchase go through an extensive rv component checklist buy my certified rv techs and, if, and please call ahead get a copy of that list so you can see how thoroughly we go over these motorhomes i can tell you this folks there's not another dealer out there that's going to take a 16 year old motorhome or excuse me 13 year old motorhome 
and put it through the test in the inspections that we do. There's not another dealer out there that, that most dealers you go to, the RV's 13 years old, they sell it to you as is. Or they charge you a couple thousand dollars for an inspection fee. No, folks, it's included. 49.9 includes our inspection and us repairing anything on that list that does not function at no additional cost to you. In other words, folks, that price is guaranteed. 49.9 is guaranteed price and everything on that list, which you should have a copy of as soon as you call, working flawlessly. You also get a 90-day nationwide limited warranty that we purchase on your behalf, accepted at a network of dealers nationwide. Because when we started advertising on the Internet years and years ago, we realized, folks, that a warranty from us for somebody that lives 2,000 miles away is worthless. They're not going to drive it back here 2,000 miles for a three or $400 repair. If, in the rare occasion, you need a warranty repair in the first 90 days. That's why we check everything out beforehand so we know you're not going to need it. We want you to be able to take it to the campground as soon as you pick it up and use it um, without any worries. That's what we strive for. But we do know that, um, uh, you know, occasionally things break. Nothing man-made is perfect, folks. You go to these new dealerships, you look in their service uh, yard, it's all full of, uh, of six-month and, and one-year-old motorhomes that people paid a whole lot more money than this for, and they're in there for warranty repairs. In fact, the average new RV goes in for a little over three warranty repairs in the two-year factory warranty that comes with a brand new one. So, it's a good thing about buying used is people's used it, they've got the bugs worked out most of the time, and we make sure of that. However, this network of dealers, when you're always welcome to bring it back to us for warranty repairs, but if, you, if it's inconvenient for you to do so, you can take it to another dealer in the network that's closer to where you live. So we give you options, and we buy that on your behalf and include it for that $49.9 price. Um, you get that 90-day warranty, you get a drive-out tag, no additional charge, you get a five-gallon bucket starter kit with all your camping essentials, sewer hose, water hose, pressure reducers, pressure uh, adapters, chemicals, toilet paper, and more. Uh, you also get a walk-through demonstration. The way it works, folks, after you purchase this RV, um, uh, it goes in line to get checked out in our shop. It takes us about a week, week and a half. Of course, again, you want to verify that with your salesperson before deciding to buy it because our workload changes day to day. and They'll give you an estimate on how quick we can get this thing done. Now, folks, now I say we haven't checked it, but we have checked the major stuff. We know the generator works. We know it runs and drives like it's supposed to. We know the AC in the front works. The roof air works. We know the refrigerator's cold. We know the TV works. We know the lights work. And uh, we know the, uh, the electric heat works. And we're going to take it one step further and check the furnace, check the water heater, plumbing system, propane system, awning, uh, and much more. And all that will be explained on that list that you should call ahead and get before deciding to buy from us or not. And um, so, you can, so even if you do take the as-is price, you can rest assured all the major systems that would cost you the most money if they didn't work, do work if that makes sense. Anyway, folks, um, after this unit's paid for, it goes in line. Once it gets checked out, uh, my cleaning crew gets a hold of it, cleans it inside and out. Then my service manager, Gordy, does his final walkthrough. If he's satisfied with everything, he'll lock it up, keep everybody out of it, uh, like customers and things like that, and then he will call you to set up an appointment for you to pick up your new-to-you motorhome. Once you arrive at that appointed time, uh, the RV tech that checked it out knows it better than anybody is going to unlock it, go through it with you, go through the checklist with you of everything that we inspected, which you should already have a copy of, um, and check off everything he shows you works, and then have you sign it at the end that you're satisfied with it. Uh, he'll answer any questions you have. He'll give you tips, tricks, and pointers. He'll help you uh, uh, show you any repairs he had to do. And you're also welcome to record them with your phone or a camera. And uh, and we know the first thing you're going to want to do is take your uh, uh, leisure travel camping. We're going to give you 21 nights of free camping, folks, up to seven nights at a time in a 12-month period um, at select RV resorts nationwide. I mean, $1,000 worth of free camping, yours for the taking. 
included. So wow, that's a lot of stuff for under 50 grand. We're family owned and operated since 1968. Count that off in your head, folks. That's 50 years in business. Now, family owned and operated three generations. Now, if that's not a true testimony to how we conduct our business, the customer service we have, the quality of the RVs we sell and the price we sell them for, I can't say it any better than 50 years in business, three generations, family owned and operated. Because, folks, I know there are thousands of RV dealers out there nationwide. And if we didn't do something right, do you think we would be in business anywhere near as long as we have been? Plus, we sell five to 600 used RVs a year. We've got one location. We've got 150 plus used RVs in stock, folks. And uh, we're all used. I mean, I've got a new line of travel trailers and that's it. Everything else is used. And primarily used motorhomes is what we sell. So put our experience and expertise to work for you. We can save you some money. We don't nickel and dime you to death. We're not like other RV dealerships that add on fees after fees after the purchase price. You know, you go to these other RV dealerships, they can add thousands of dollars in dock fees and prep fees and tag and title fees and uh, uh, inspection fees, setup fees, freight fees, etc. We have no extra fees, folks. $49.9 is option A price if you choose the option A. You get the warranty, you get the inspection, you get the free camping, you get the walkthrough demonstration, starter kit, temporary tag, and much more. $49.9 plus applicable sales tax, haggle free, that's it. One price store. Just very easy, very simple. No stress, no worries. That's an option A price. Now, we do offer it what we call option B, which is technically an as is price. Option B. Now, keep in mind, we've checked the major stuff already for you, so you don't have to worry about that. But option B uh, means you buy the, we give you a discounted price, offer already low asking price, but you have to give up the warranty, you have to give up the inspection, you have to give up the walkthrough demonstration, the cleanup, the free camping, and more. The option B price saves us time and money, so we pass that along to you. And uh, you buy the motorhome just like you see in the video. As is, you're 100% responsible for any current or future repairs this RV needs or may need. I uh, understand there's no excluded systems to that. It doesn't matter if it's running gear, motor, transmission, generator, fridge, air. It doesn't matter, folks. It's as is. If something breaks or something is broken, it's your responsibility to fix it if you choose to do so. Option B, though, that's what as is means. There's no warranty. We're not going to fix anything on it that we find. We're not going to inspect it. You just basically jump in and go price as is, kind of like you buy from sale by owner. Now, I know that's a disadvantage, but the advantages of option B is you pick it up the same day you pay for it, and, of course, you get a pretty good discount off our already low asking price because we don't have to pay for the warranty. We don't have to pay for the inspection. We don't have to pay the tech to do all that. Uh, and more. So we're happy to pass those savings along to you with a discounted price. If you want a haggle-free price on option B, again, we don't take offers, folks. The, you know, We'll give you a price either way. Either way you want to do it, that's the price. Uh, contact my sales department at 706-965-7929. They'll give you an option B price. So very, very simple. One price store or two price if you want to count option B. This is what I recommend, folks, and I recommend this with any used vehicle that you're looking to buy. If you are able to, travel here and inspect this motorhome. Look at it, test drive it, inspect it before you decide if this is the one for you or not, if you are able to. If you're not able to, you know, we'll do our best to accommodate you and put it in and and help you eliminate any doubts you have about buying something. We can send you custom pictures, custom videos. Just let your salesperson know what you want to see. And if you're willing to pay for it, we can even recommend a third-party RV service that can come out and inspect it for you. That does not work for us. So, um, but you'll have to pay for that, of course. So we'll do anything we can. And of course, we do offer nationwide delivery, folks. I've got. I've got a driver on his way to New York State right now delivering a Class B camper van that we sold up there. 
you uh, you just don't realize how far away people travel for these vans and they're in high demand very very short supply as most of you already know they've been searching the internet for a class b van for under fifty thousand dollars and i actually have two of these right now one for this one and the one with a higher mileage for 44.9 so definitely got options for you folks anyway 49.9 option a contact us for option b includes warranty and all those other features 706-965-7929 financing is available with approved credit minimum 10 percent down payment is mandatory and you're welcome to look this unit up online check the nadas and all those other things check rv trader ebay and everywhere else that people list rvs you're going to see this one and you're going to see every other one for sale in the country and you're going to see pretty quick this is an incredible deal um Give us a call right away. As always, don't travel down here without calling ahead to make sure a unit's still available. I do not delete my YouTube videos. Today is November 12th, if I'm not mistaken, uh, 2018. So keep in mind, a week from now, this thing's probably sold. Uh, call ahead. Always call ahead, even if it's the same day the video is published, to make sure it's still available. I've sold these things in as quick as 45 minutes after posting a video. Um, so keep that in mind. I've got 13,000 plus subscribers. Would love to count you among them that sees my videos every time I post one. So these things don't sit around long, folks. And that's not counting the people that share it to their buddies and, and, and groups and all that stuff. So uh, please call ahead before driving any significant distance to come here to look at it and make sure it's still available. You may want to make an appointment with a salesperson. Not required, but recommended. Um, if you want to fly in, we pick up several sets of customers a week at the Chattanooga, Tennessee Airport. Very easy airport to fly in and out of. We'll pick you up for free during business hours. Just give us a call beforehand. Let us know your travel plans, and we'll accommodate you. Um, again, folks, best way to reach us by phone, 706-965-7929. Evenings, uh, that number's answered 24-7. You can email us, sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. You can click on my website uh, in the video description below if you're on YouTube or just go to parkwayrvcenter.com. I've got credit apps, I've got pictures, I've got a lot more information on this motorhome than on the video. And um, I've specs, tank sizes, and much more. Forgot to mention, folks, this motorhome has a 500 mile travel range on just a 26 gallon fuel tank. That's impressive, folks. Like I said, that's uh, incredible fuel mileage. Thank you again for watching. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, 